All right, I got thinking about something. You know, whenever you look at a mattress, it's got the little ridges in it. It's kind of like diamond-shaped puffy parts. Well, I got thinking, how would you go about creating that all at one time? And I got thinking about, and I'm let me re, let me say this first. I'm sure there are better ways to go about this. But I got thinking, how can I do this with physics? Being that I kind of like physics. I mean, most of my stuff has to do with physics. So I got thinking, let's do it with the cloth simulator. So I created, let me hide this real quick. I created this simple little box and I made that a collision object. Simple enough, right? Then I added this cube. Let me hide this one. I added this cube inside of it and I subdivided it. The subdivisions on the side are half as dense and the subdivisions on the bottom are half as dense as the subdivisions on top. And this is going to be my cloth. Alright, I put that inside this box. And then I create this lattice and make that a collision object. And then whenever I go to the cloth settings, set the quality settings to 6, turn the pressure up to 60, which is kind of high, and the quality settings on the collision up to 6. And now, let me go ahead and hide this one. Now when I press play, it inflates and fills up and presses against the top lattice. And now I have a, a mattress that's fully formed. And all I have to do is basically come over here to the modifiers tab and then apply the modifier and now I can get rid of everything else and I'll have to do is just do some final sculpting or modifying of this to make it look more realistic but it's for the most part it's most of the way there and it didn't take long at all but anyway later people